big, natural, beautiful, hair effect. Cause I don't curl. This is getting on my lash. Good nerve. Y'all see how I did that? He will never put more on you than you can bear. You know that, don't you? I spaced them. I spaced them, cousin. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's the, the, um, you have to. I'm trying to told you. You're going to be Scarisha if you do that. And wig shine is not mine. You already know that. Mm-mm. Nah. You see what I'm saying? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cousins, it's your girl, man. K coming to you with the slay today. I felt like being big and bold and beautiful and voluptuous. Mm -mm. I just felt like being nutritious and delicious today. So I said, I'm going to do some big her because I don't curl. I'm going to give you the details on this. What I did to achieve this very fast, very easy look. Oh, right after I show love to my subscriber of the day. Damn. You are the bomb. Y'all, make sure that you hit that subscribe button so you can join the family and join the fun. Y'all wouldn't believe how my cousin cut up. Y'all, I just wanted to tell you a few very specific things about this hair and the process that I chose to install. Now for this hair. So this hair is from Janet Collection. This is from their Nala Trust line, but this is their Afro Nala Trust line, you know, because it's like really natural and it gives you that big natural beautiful hair effect this is their new curl bay hair they have i believe 4a and 4b this is 4a so it's like a coil but it's not super tight but it's super tight you see what i'm saying no yeah, yeah, yeah. And I have colors 1B and then OET 1B30, which is the brown that you see. Okay, the hair is 10 inches. And you guys are going to see all of this at the end of the video, so do not fret. Y'all, I, I had to fix the angle of the camera. I know I'm like angled really differently today. That's because I'm sitting down in my chair today. So, yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's the... The um, you have to the degrees of it. You could you have to angle to the degree. See because for the overall look of it, it's supposed to have a natural feel, and it does. It does have a natural feel, so it's not overly soft, but it's not rough, and it has a very healthy luster. Not wiggy because wig shine is not mine. You already know that. So that's a plus. So this is a wig that I created using a wig cap. Um, the wig cap that you will see in the demo is in my um Amazon store. So if you guys want that wig cap, it is in the store. But tamarama. So I just crocheted it into my crochet wig cap. So that's what I did to achieve this look. It really went fast y'all because of the the way that the hair is sectioned. Okay, so you get two bundles of hair in one pack and you have these little sections of hair and it's already pre-looped. There's a little band on there that you can pull down to make the loop bigger, crochet it in the wig cap and then tighten it back up. But in that one loop, there are like four, like three or four pieces of hair. So it makes the install go very, very fast. You'll see how far I spaced my pieces in the demo. I spaced them, I spaced them cousin. Cause see, you know, you don't want to put these back to back. You don't want to put these one and two finger with apart, honey, because you are going to have you some, you're going to have you some scar to you. You're going to be Scarisha if you do that. And mm-mm, mm-mm. You don't want you don't want that. You we want to be more so Mufasa, you know, Mufasa Lena. That's 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 where we at with it. So in order to do that, you have to watch your spacing. So that's something very important that I wanted to say before you see the demo. Use a wig head, y'all. If y'all are going to start making wigs, invest in different size wig canvas heads. I use the twenty one because that's my head size. Um, my head is on the smaller side because actually I used to make wigs like all the time for, for other people. So I have like 21 through 24. Basically, it's just this right here. This baddie right here, okay? You can see she has been, honey, he will never put more on you than you can bear. You know that, don't you? I be having it because honey, she done been through it all. This is my 21. So 
Whew. So I use Sheila. This is, this is Sheila, by the way. That's what I use to put the wig cap on and to crochet into this. So bam, you get the size that correlates with your domology, okay? So make sure you get the right size, okay, cousin? Y'all, this lash is getting on my last. This is getting on my lash. Good nerve. Y'all see how I did that? Uh-uh, hold on. Okay, y'all, I had to pause for the call, honey, because there was a little piece of lash in my eye. I thought I was going to be up out of here. I can't stand with something being in my eye now. I had to call on the Lord because I don't like that feeling, honey. Y'all like that feeling when something is in your eye? I can't. My nerves be bad. But anyways, okay, so yes, I literally just fluffed like this. That's it. After the install, I just went through fluff. I could have left it as is, but I wanted to cut it. I wanted it to be in a specific shape, so I did that. But you don't have to do that. I know people think like all you need is kind of real tightly curly hair to make a wig like this, but y'all not all curly hair is created equally, y'all. <sighs> wow. Some of these curl, I'm telling you, sometimes it can be rough, honey. Just cause it's curly don't mean, listen, I'ma tell you what my pastor told me. Sitting in the church don't make you no deacon. <laughs> Just being curly don't mean it's gonna be efficient for your needs, okay? <laughs> I'm trying to told you. With this hair, you can make so many different styles. You can make passion twist styles like this, kinky twists. You can keep the curls as they are when you install them, their original um, pattern. You can fluff it out like I did. If you wanna be big, bold, and beautiful, you feel me? You can do what you wanna do. Ponytails, buns, space buns, there's so many different things. And this is gonna give you a really natural look. So, and of course they have tons of different colors as Janet Collection normally does. And as normally, you can get these from your local beauty supply or online if your local beauty supply does not carry these. But those are the things that I wanted to explain to you before I got you to the demo, okay? I just wanted you to know how important spacing is so that you don't put too much hair in. I end up using four and a half packs of hair. If you use a cap like I did, I would suggest doing the invisible crochet along the part. Everything else, just go ahead and go. You just go, you just go, you just glow. You feel me? If you wanna fluff, you fluff. If you don't, don't, you feel me? And that's it. That's E. <laughs> I'm gonna get you to the demo. I know we used to be cutting up, but I'm gonna get you over to the video. If you have any questions, let me know. If you want to see other styles made into wigs, also let me know. All right. Big shout out to Janard's collection for this here slay. To the demo. Peace, love, like.
Oh, but kind of new 